Hello, welcome in this video tutorial. Today we are going to discuss uh, how to sell physical goods material to the cluster partners. Cluster partners is uh, mm, cluster partners are the partners which are providing uh, the support and uh, technical support and uh, provisioning, maintenance, and other services in the CFA section, consumer fixed access, like in the broadband in the landline, in the FTTH, Bharat Fiber, Air Fiber and all, fine. So if we are issuing the material from our uh, company stores to these cluster partners, then there is a process developed by our ERP coating. You need to follow this process to sell the physical goods material. First, you need to uh, create the customer uh, in the use uh, by sending the data to the SDL2 of the circle with the following details like uh, customer for the cluster partners, customer account group Z001, sales area is this 0314. I'm just going to sales organization is this sales office is this, sales group is this and you need to choose the order type is ZMIS physical goods sales fine and a division should be So here your main objective is to sales area should be this distribution channel this and 14 is the okay so while creating the sales order you need to follow this you need to execute the transaction code VA01 uh, fill in the sales organization your circle code in the distribution channel you need to fill 03 and in the division you need to press 14 okay for example here I am just choosing ZMIS sales organization is 1030 okay distribution channel you need to choose 3 enterprise business and in the division you need to choose 14 telecom factory production okay then you need to press on the enter And uh, once you press the enter, then uh, following screen is appear. Okay. Like uh, you need to fill the customer code and uh, purchase order number, the purchase order date. Okay. Purchase order dates, required quantities materials and all you need to fill okay and uh, the you need to fill the plant code okay so create the physical good sales for example uh, uh, this is the material this is the order quantity one this is the jointing kits okay and the value of this is 3013.57 okay purchase order number test because uh, here we are showing the test data okay total amount is this with tax okay and uh, here you need to uh, go in the condition tab and this is the MAP, MAP value is this GST is this okay blaze plus this okay so TCS value is this and 
all the conditions is maintained here so total amount is 3556 means 3013.57 is our base amount and tax amount is 546 okay pricing will be automatically determined based on the moving average price maintained in the plant verify pricing in the condition tab and save the sales order once you save sales order a sales order number will generate and that will be used for the further case okay okay physical good sales 3005106 has been saved now you need to create outbound delivery by transaction code VL01N with respect to sales order fill the shipping point as a plant code and press enter you need to execute VL01N shipping point selection date is current date and the order that is the sales order okay by default this is with sales order reference once you click on the enter the sales order detail will be fetched here okay and uh, material is this plant is this storage location is this from which storage location you need to uh, transfer your material to the cluster partners numbers is this and all in the picking tab this thing is showing okay then you need to click on the post good issue tab okay once you post click on the post good issue tab okay the system will uh, plan gi date plan good issue date is this actual good issue date is this okay and uh, ship to party that is the customer code total weight is this what is the joint key tsf6 is this okay. once you click on the post code issue and save then obd number is created okay you just need down you just need to note down okay this outbound delivery number fine now the next part is you need to create sales invoice through transaction code vf01 okay with respect to outbound delivery number once you execute the transaction code vf01 billing type it jmis invoice and uh, fill the obd then this is the obd number okay and in the invoice create overview of the billing items what is the description jointing kit tsf6 okay this is the invoice type payer is this this is customer code billing date is this net value is this without tax okay material is this cost is this okay once you save the invoice number is generated all the data is reflecting here the net amount is this tax amount is this okay and once you save the data from ver after verification in the condition tab invoice number has been created now check and verify the accounting document generated print out of the invoice can be taken through vf03 through output type if no output defined message displayed go to vf02 enter invoice number select output type jdxc double click on the line item select logical destination take print out decode vf03 output type jdxc how to take the print out we have already created the video how to take the printout of the sales invoice okay this is the once you save the data this is the sales invoice number okay so this is all about how you can uh, give the physical goods to the sales part uh, cluster partners and how you can maintain all these things in our SAP. Before uh, issuing these things, uh, you should uh, maintain these things. Uh, customers to be created by SDL2 with the following condition customer account group Z001, sales area is uh, circle code, and EB sales, and uh, the channel sales 14. Customer account assignment group under billing 
document tab under sales area 07 cluster revenue material to be should material to be should material to be sold should be extended for distribution channel 03 by respective circle through ERP MM MDM team of ITPC Nachon. Okay. So before going to create the sales order, these things to be maintained. Okay. Hope you understand these things. Please share this knowledge with your colleagues and friends. Okay. And don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. And also not to forget to press the bell icon for our latest video updates. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice day.